I recently found this story called God is Never Wrong. It's an interesting story. A king who did not believe in the goodness of God had a slave who in all circumstances would always say, My king, do not be discouraged because everything God does is perfect. He makes no mistakes. One day they went hunting, and along the way a wild animal attacked the king. The slave managed to kill the animal but could not prevent his majesty from losing a finger. Furious and without showing his gratitude for being saved, the nobleman asked, Is God good? If he was good, I would not have been attacked and lost my finger. The slave replied, My king, despite all these things, I can only tell you that God is good. He knows why these things happened. What God does is perfect. He is never wrong. Outraged by that response, the king ordered the arrest of his slave. Later, the king went on another hunt. This time alone, he was captured by savages who engaged in human sacrifices. And ready to sacrifice the nobleman, the savages discovered that their victim did not have one of its fingers. According to them, only a whole person with all his or her parts intact could be offered to the gods. So the king, without a finger, was deemed an abominable sacrifice for their gods. So they released the king. Upon his return to the palace, the king authorized the release of his slave. He received the slave affectionately. God was really good to me. I was almost killed by the wild men, but for the lack of a single finger, I was let go. But I have a question. If God is so good, why did he allow me to put you in jail? The slave answered, My king, if I had gone with you on this hunt, I would have been sacrificed instead because I have no missing finger. Remember, everything God does is perfect. He is never wrong. He made you keep me in jail so I would not be with you on the hunt. Often we complain about life and negative things that happen to us, forgetting that nothing is random and that everything has a purpose. Every morning, offer your day to God and don't be in rush. Ask God to inspire your thoughts, guide your actions, and ease your feelings. And do not be afraid. God is never wrong. You know why this message is for you? I do not know. But God knows, because he never makes mistakes. What you do with this message is up to you. May God put it in your heart to desire to send it to someone or share it with someone. God knows why we chose to receive this message. Please bless someone with it. God is never wrong. When you feel like you're drowning in life, don't worry. Your lifeguard walks on water. So this story reminded me of an article that Pam Hipshire had given me from the South Bend Tribune a few years back. It's uh, Lovina's Amish Kitchen, an Amish lady who does a, a regular article in the South Bend Tribune. And she had been talking about an accident in which one of the children were killed. And it was a buggy car accident, I believe. And, and some other losses that they had had in their family. And her statement was, God makes no mistakes. I've underlined that. I've kept this in my Bible because it continually reminds me God makes no mistakes. And I keep saying, I need that faith. I need to stand by that and know he cares for me and that whatever he does is good for me. And that's the lesson for today. God is never wrong. He never makes mistakes. Put that in your heart and believe it. Thank you.